Good morning, Year 9. Um, we're going to do a quick lesson completing an Afrobeat challenge. So in this lesson, our challenge is going to be creating just firstly an intro and a chorus using loops that are available on BandLab for an Afrobeat challenge, okay? So first things first, we are going to go and open up a project, which you would have done, you know how to do. Um, and um, first thing you're going to do is when you add a new track, say like so, Instead of going new tracks normal, you're going to click browse loops. And what pops up is this section of loops. It will show you loop packs. I want you to scroll the way down. You're going to go past me and bounce. And you're going to go to where it says Afrobeat. Um, as we have been focusing on Afrobeat this term. Okay. So in Afrobeat, you're able to see the different type of instruments that we want to use and different things available. There's drums, xylophones. Um there's an accordion so first thing I want to do is I want to create a type of sound so if I start with this sound I feel like this could be a good little part of my introduction so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it and I'm going to drop drag and I drop oh, do drag and drop okay there we go we've got that I'm going to drag that so that it is, there we go. Okay, lovely. Next thing is we need to find our next instrument. So we've got this kind of xylophone type sound. But in the xylophone sound, it tells me that the key is E minor. Okay, so I'm now going to find a synth. But I want to find a synth again that's in E minor. Okay, all these synths are in E minor, so... Maybe something like this, we'll just drag in and drop. I'm gonna start it at bar 7, um, so we've got a little synth sound, we could also... Let's go into the pluck now. So, so the guitar sound, remember we have to remember to keep in the right key because if this is in C minor it's not going to work. So we can use this one, E minor. This is quite nice. Let's drag this one in. Okay, let's see some percussion. make that the key is 100 and the BPM sorry is 120 as it has been so I'm just going to drag this in no reaper yeah we could choose this as another sound again <clears throat> there's also hand drums I like this one too. Okay, so we've got hand drums. We've got now. Let's see what other regular drums we've got. So we've got to remember here. If we look here, this BPM is slower. So we want to skip the ones that say one ten. I'm gonna drag in this one now. Now we need to make sure it's on the right one. That's the only next thing. Make sure you scroll down. Okay, so I've got drums in, so now let's just have a look at the bass. It's fine. I like this one the most, I think. So we've got bass now. Now let's clear our accordion. I'm going to drag in this one now. Now, these might not all work together, but that is not my end goal. 
I want to drag in and see what I've got and see what might work in together the best. So let's hear this xylophone thing again. There's that. Then we have... I'm going to just make this a bit shorter. The reason why, I just want to hear each different bit and see what I like the most. Okay, I get the gist of that one. Um, that one's okay. Now I'm going to solo this one. Let's see what this one sounds like. I like that one a lot. Let's go to this one. Okay, so I like those. So the first thing I think I'm going to start with, and it's quite a lot on here, I believe, is this Mariba. Fill it to the beginning. Okay. Let's start there. And I'm going to pull this xylophone back and up there. How long we can make this for? Um, eight par. I think then after it's played up there it'd be nice to introduce another instrument here and I did say I think this hang drum went with it so we're going to bring in the hang drum at the beginning of it. Now you'll notice the more you add on here the kind of slower it moves but get, be patient with it. If you can close the things in your background I've got quite a lot of tabs open as you can see. Um, so. I really like that together. We're going to carry on with this theme. Let's drag this one longer. Let's drag it here for now. Same thing with this. Really cute together. I feel like we don't need to add the drums for quite a bit, it seems. Uh, then, so we've got our two Mariba sound. It probably works then to have a bit of percussion or bass come in. I think we should introduce the next idea at bar 13. So let's bring in the bass here. And we'll drag these longer again. This one can continue. So the bass is going to come in about here. Yeah, the accordion is not going to come in for a while and I'm not going to bother move it now. So let us just hear that bass sounds like. Okay, so I'm now going to mute, mute these other lines just so they're out the way again. So, there's a lot a lot of latency but one thing I did notice is the bass can coming way way sooner so I'm gonna drag the bass all the way now to bar 9 instead brilliant okay let's start from the beginning and have a listen
massive fan of that base part. So I'm going to just take it and I'm going to delete it because again, I don't really like it. I'm going to press delete track. So now I've got these two little pieces together. It could be cool for this accordion type sound to come in. So I'm going to unmute it and I'm going to press play and I'm going to mute these two pieces just so it's not going to play. <laughs> bring this in at 17 I think and this one just playing and dragging around and seeing how I see fit. Let's make this a bit longer. Again, I'm making sure that all of my beats start on a whole number on the lines here. I'm going to press save on that because it has got a bit crazy on here as there's been a lot of different things. I'm going to call this Afrobeat Party. Because I don't know, we made it in five seconds. Near enough. Afrobeat Party. Ooh. Okay, so we have our basic sections in here. As you can see, and as the video I've shown you, as well as the uh, PDF links, oh, PDF, sorry, attachments added as well. Um, You'll be able to see how structures come in. With intros, things instruments really come over in at one after the other. Sometimes they overlap with each other. So it's your job to really play around with it. Um, in the upcoming project, we're going to be doing something, creating something to a horror film. So it is your job to really play around with this. 